All right, welcome to another one of my videos about Eagle Moss and their Star Trek The Official Starships Collection. This video is about issue 65, the Zindi Aquatic Cruiser from the TV show Enterprise. It was issued in February 2016. And this is how it looked like in the box. On this side of the box you can see the logos of the four main uh, Star Trek TV shows. This is a warning that this is not for children. Again, collector's model not designed and intended for play by children under 14 years of age in different languages. And the logo of the main original Star Trek TV show. Star Trek.com 2015 CBS Studios. Okay, let's get the thing out of the box. And this is the ship. Again, it has a lot of surface detail, as you can see, very interesting paint job also. As you can see, in the front there is the engineering section. Below it is the hangar bay. And I'm not sure why, but it reminds me of some sea creature that was probably their intention but it's really an interesting design definitely inspired by nature and real creatures okay let's take a look at the stand Zindi Aquatic Cruiser, trademark and copyright 2015, CBS Studios Incorporated. The model itself was released by Eagle Moss in 2016. And let's pull all the parts together. You can see it's not really 100% stable, but it's able to hold the ship. If you manage to put it there. But thankfully it goes there only from this side. And again, some more detailed information about the different parts of the ship. And let's take a look at the model from all of the sides. Zoom out a bit, a little bit.
Okay, this is the magazine. Every model comes with this nice printed magazine. It starts with the table of content. Specification of the ship. And the following pages contain a nice new CGI renderer of the model and an article about the ship. These are pictures from Star Trek Enterprise, which is the show on which the Zindi were the main villains in season 3. The following two pages contain, again, detailed information about the ship. The green thing is the crew window. There is the phase deflector, pulse, particle beam emitter, and so on. Creating the aquatics. They were unfortunately fully CGI and I must say they look absolutely fake. Just like all the CGI creatures used in Enterprise. I would probably prefer if they used some old-fashioned techniques like puppets or maybe, I don't know, just something which would look at least slightly realistic. This is an article about the designing of the ship. And as usually it includes some nice pre-production pictures. Yeah, watery inspiration. More early versions of the ship. Comparing the sizes with the Enterprise. And these are the key appearances. It appeared only in the third season of Star Trek Enterprise, between the episodes Countdown and Zero Hour. And the next issue released was issue 66, USS Raven, which is a ship which was featured in Star Trek Voyager. So that's all for today. I hope you did like this little overview of issue 65. I do this kind of Eagle Moss mini reviews every Tuesday. If you do like it, uh, feel free to check any other video on my channel. You should see a couple of playlists right now on screen. And thank you very much for watching. Hope we see us next time.
Thanks for watching.